welcome friends i trust that you are enjoying and uh, being benefited by uh, what we are receiving from the study on faith um, today i want to talk about generating faith it's uh, exciting to see the things that can take place when we walk by faith but how can we get this faith uh, in our hearts and our lives um, and that's what we will see let me read for us from G- hebrews chapter 12 and verse 2 looking unto jesus the author and finisher of our faith who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross despising the shame and has sat down at the right hand of the throne of god so this scripture here says that jesus is the author and the finisher of our faith and everything in between faith begins from knowing the lord jesus faith begins with a personal relationship with the lord jesus or you know salvation in the lord jesus and from then on faith continues from who he is the knowledge of who jesus is what he can do for us you know and what the word of god reveals uh, about the very nature of the godhead so faith comes from god faith is not something you and i can get from um you know just experiences or uh, some books or something like that but we have to go to god and the very person of the lord jesus because he is the author and the finisher of our faith faith comes from god and here's another scripture that talks about generating faith or getting faith it's in romans chapter 10 and verse 17 it says so then faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of god so faith is from god uh, faith jesus is the author of faith and faith comes from hearing god's word faith comes from hearing um, again you know this needs to be understand understood as uh, receiving it and and digesting god's word faith comes from receiving god's word uh, you know wholeheartedly so we each one of us in our life situations you know we might uh, think that we don't have faith or you know uh, maybe we have faith when it comes to our uh, work life but we are struggling in our family life you know what do we do in such a situation now, we, all we have to do is to spend time in god's word let that word work in our hearts and faith is generated from god's word uh, similarly if if there are situations like um, you know someone uh, who is experiencing sickness how can they get faith i i just want to share a few scriptures that will help um, uh, and you know which will birth faith for healing exodus 15 26 where god said for i am the lord who heals you So God is a God who can heal us. Psalm 103 verses 2 and 3 says, "Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases." Whatever sickness uh, we may be facing, you no know, it's included in the all here. He heals all our diseases. In 1 Peter chapter 2 and verse 24, who himself bore our sins in his own body on the tree that we having died to sins might live for righteousness by whose stripes you were healed. We were healed through the stripes of Jesus. And faith for healing can arise out of these very scriptures. In the same way when we dwell on scriptures concerning different areas of our lives, faith will begin to rise in our hearts let's pray together heavenly father we thank you for uh, the source of faith which you have made available in your word i pray that uh, lord each of us lord will grow in our faith and god uh, in different areas of our lives father we will conquer we will experience your mighty victory in jesus name we pray amen 
Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.